Out here, in the infinite darkness of space, our planet seems peaceful. But don't be too sure. And in 1908, it sent a fiery reminder, the Tunguska event. All right, picture this, it's 1908, a normal summer morning in Siberia. The sun is shining, birds are chirping, and then, boom. The sky explodes. A fireball the size of a city lights up the sky. A shockwave flattens 80 million trees. The shockwave was so powerful, it hurled people off their feet, even from 60 kilometers away. So what just happened? That's the question scientists have been asking for over a century. June 30th, 1908, a massive explosion over 1,000 times stronger than the Hiroshima bomb rocks central Siberia. But here's the weird part. When people rushed to the site of the explosion, there's no crater, no impact site, no obvious meteor fragments. Just pure destruction. Imagine me in Chillin on a hillside and suddenly a fireball the size of a skyscraper flashes across the sky. Witnesses say it was brighter than the sun. One guy was literally thrown off by the blast wave. For decades, scientists scrambled to figure out what caused this. Was it a meteor, a comet, a secret Tesla experiment? The best guess, a space rock, about 50 meters wide, entered Earth's atmosphere at insane speeds, heated up and exploded before hitting the ground. Basically an airburst. But since it happened in one of the most remote places on Earth, no one saw it coming. What if it happens again? Experts say it's not a matter of if, but when. And if a Tunguska-level explosion happened over a major city today, let's just say, it wouldn't be pretty. <laughs>